Hey there, it's Elliot. Today, we're diving deep into iCloud activation locks, that iPhone locked to owner message that can grind your gears. Now, I know what you're thinking. The web's full of services offering to unlock your Apple devices for a fee. And you're not wrong, but let me tell you, not all of them are as shiny as they seem. Hold your horses. Don't take your time choosing the first piece of software you come across. Sure, some might work, but they also leave you with a lighter wallet and potential risks to your device. But don't worry, I've got your back. I will show you a much better, safer, and accessible alternative, guaranteed to get you back into your iPhone, iPad, or Apple Watch in no time. Stay tuned, folks, because you don't want to miss this one. Let's keep things straightforward. This guidance is only for device owners who need help remembering their login details. We're not here to help anyone do anything illegal, like unlock stolen devices. So, let's respect the law and everyone's rights. Rest assured, our video adheres to YouTube's rules and community norms. Now, let's get back to it. Discovering that an iPhone is locked to a previous owner's iCloud account can throw a wrench into your plans, but don't worry. You have many reliable tools. Unlock Here's AI Unlocking Assistant is a game changer. It uses advanced AI technology to guide you through the process, helping you unlock your device relatively quickly. Safe Unlocks, on the other hand, is a dedicated service committed to solving iCloud lock issues. Its user-friendly online process quickly removes iCloud locks from your device, then you have Lock to Owner. This tool is all about hassle-free unlocking, with a user-friendly interface and swift turnaround times. Lastly, the iUnlock app makes unlocking as simple as tapping a few buttons. It cuts through the complexities of iCloud opening, offering a streamlined unlocking process. These services use technology that aligns with Apple's guidelines, ensuring your device will be unlocked without any damage or data loss. They're also safe and work regardless of the carrier the device is locked to. We'll soon delve into a step-by-step -step walkthrough of how to use Unlock Here's AI Unlocking Assistant. So, stay tuned to get a grip on the entire procedure. Remember that the unlocking services mentioned earlier mainly operate in first world countries, but don't sweat it if you can't access them or prefer not to use them. We've got you covered. Every week, we allot 250 unlocks for users who watch our videos. All you have to do is follow these simple steps to enter the draw. Like this video, subscribe to our channel, in the comment section below, mention your phone model like the Samsung S9, your IMEI, and your country. And that's it. Once you complete these steps, you're automatically entered for a free unlock. So go ahead and get cracking. Okay, let's jump right in. Grab your phone or computer and tap unlockhere.com into your browser. This isn't just any old site. It's an AI assistant powered web app that'll help you remove any mobile phone restriction. Once you're on the site, you'll meet Nifty. Tell Nifty you need an iCloud unlock. You'll see an option called Activation Lock. Click on that. Next, tell Nifty what kind of device you have. If it's an iPhone, for example, pick that. But if it's an iPad or Apple Watch, that works too. Now we're at the point where you'll need your IMEI or serial number. Are you confused? No worries. iPhones have IMEIs, so if you've got an iPhone, choose IMEI iPads and Apple Watches can be different. If they have a SIM card slot or cellular capacity, they'll have an IMEI. But you'll only have a serial number if there's no SIM card slot. So where do you find this info? It's easy. Just press your device's sleep button. Press it again and tap the little I on the bottom right. This will show you your device info. Don't skip the next part because you'll need to enter your device information. Now, it's time to provide some basic information to attach the order to your account. Make sure the information is legitimate because you'll receive a confirmation code via email that you'll need to confirm. Before you get moving, make sure you check off that you agree to the terms and that you're not trying to unlock a stolen device. Solve the quick captcha to confirm you're not a robot, then tap Start Process. You'll get an email with a confirmation code. Sometimes it ends up in your spam or junk folder, so check there too. Once you got the code, go back to the Unlock Here website, enter the confirmation code, Prove you're not a robot once again, and the unlocking process will start. Your device will be unlocked before you know it. As you can see here, we swipe up to see the iPhone locked to owner page. In this part, it really takes time and patience. We wait for the unlock process to activate the phone. And as you can see, we swipe left and wait for a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Don't worry, it will be worth the wait. You will enjoy your phone once again, once it's finally unlocked. 
so it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Patience is the key here. And there it is. In this part, let's skip all the setup. Don't worry, you can go back to set it all up later. Make sure to check the terms and conditions and skip the rest of the steps and just do it all later on. And there you have it. It says, welcome to iPhone. Now, go to settings and create your own Apple ID. Tap forget password or don't have Apple ID to create a new one. And here you can just add your personal details to continue. And here's a shortcut to check your device info, making sure that this is legit. And yeah, your device is now fully unlocked and ready to use. All right, guys, let's explore alternative ways to remove that iCloud activation lock. These methods are legal, but they might not be the best known. So remember, you heard about them here first. First, try the good old fashioned Find My iPhone route. If you have the previous owner's details, they can remove the activation lock remotely. They need to access iCloud.com account, select Find iPhone, choose the device and click on Remove from account. Another route is to contact Apple support. You need proof of purchase that clearly shows you are the legitimate owner. Apple emphasizes user security, so they will only help if they're convinced you're not trying any funny business. If you bought the device from a third party, such as an online marketplace or a store, and you have the original receipt, you can take it to an Apple store or an authorized service provider. As long as everything checks out, they can help the unlocking process. There are even more ways to remove iCloud activation locks, some of which might surprise you. So stay tuned and I'll see you in the next one.